Mr. President, we are requesting you, the four months that are remaining, come to Kisi. Thank the people of Kisi for electing you twice and tell them goodbye. Go to Nyanza, tell them goodbye. Go to the coast, tell them goodbye. Go to Northeastern, tell them goodbye. Go to Central, tell them goodbye. Go to Nairobi and tell them goodbye. And when you finish, go to Tanzania. You are the chairman of the East African community. Go to Tanzania, address the parliament of Tanzania and tell them Kwairini. Go to Uganda and do the same. Go to Sudan, go to Burundi, go to Rwanda and tell them goodbye. That is the work of a retiring president. The work of a retiring president is not to mess around with the country, trying to divide the country at the time when you are leaving office. Tunakuomba kwa eshima, usijipake matope kwa kujaribu kuuza mzigo wa azimio kwa sababu utaanguka. Si namna hiyo? Si azimio inaanguka? Si inaanguka? So, Mr. President, you should be a very grateful person. God has enabled you to lead the, our country. And not many Kenyans have been fortunate to lead this country. There are very many people who are even more qualified than you, but they have not been fortunate to lead this country. You must thank God that you are one of the four Kenyans in the history of our country who have sat in the seat of the president of our country. Lakini ukianza kujaribu kuendeleza uongozi wako na mlango ya nyuma kutuletea mtu wa azimio ati ndio huo unamcontrol ujue ya kwamba mheshimiwa rais utaingia kwa shimo na utatoka Please copy the example of president Mwai Kibaki